Welcome back. This week, while you were busy changing your closet over for the season, the designers were fighting to stay in the game. They're all nervous. Clearly, they're all nervous. But some show it, some don't show it. It's sweet. They had 15 minutes to prove themselves to the judges. Literally 15 minutes with a timer. But we're going to show you what they've got in a matter of seconds. Let the games begin. Hats are an integral part of the story. This piece here uh, speaks to the future. Farrell will like that. <laughs> if there was one word to describe Grey Ant, it would be innovative. Is there anything you want to add about this one, Nat? No. <clears throat> Thank you very much. Edie Parker was inspired by the original acrylic handbags made in the 1950s. Do we get to touch yeah, them? Yeah, bring them back. Oh. These are a little bit taped down. We can move closer to you, that's good. In other words, you don't want us to touch. All the judges were passing the bags around and talking amongst themselves. I think I could have been like, watermelon, watermelon, nobody would have noticed. Orly is a menswear label with a heavy focus on knitwear. And do you have other work, or this is 100% of your work? And this is 100% of our work. This is 100% taking bank loans and... Well, we have a little food out there. <laughs> People in my store have sort of referenced your shoes to be like others. I think that the minute you put my shoe on your foot, it doesn't feel like anyone else's. I mean, it's the reason... I'm working okay. with all of these. Final okay. <laughs> my name's Tanya, and I am the CEO and designer of Tanya Taylor. If I could describe my brand in one word, it would be expression. We're a contemporary lifestyle brand utilizing indigo throughout our collection. What is it that you're offering that's special and different? We really emphasize the the, F, the work that goes into each gene. We, we, we do focus a lot on... Yeah, I think also, too, um... Who is the brand that you want to grow up to be? Valentino from the 60s, 70s, and 80s. I fell in love with that magic. All right, Wes, thank, thank you. you. I lived, I didn't faint, I didn't die. So that was a win. Ryan Roche is a modern feminine brand. Very nice. It's a big specialty business right now. She's so small. But she's so good. My name's Ava, and I'm here today to present my collection, Ava Farron. Can they come a little closer? They asked me questions from the second I got in there. This is one bracelet or three? Yeah. So this is a chain And what does of... it look like in the back? And you make everything where? And who is your customer? I was really thinking about myself as my customer. No, no, I know, but no. So, um, oh, all right, never mind. I'm very relieved that that is over. <laughs> Well, that looked like fun. It starts for 15 minutes and it goes on for another four months. There's an awful lot of talking and a lot of showing and a lot of presenting still to come. We hope they're ready for this. See you next week. For more fashion fun, visit OvationTV.com.